Hey guys, welcome to a new episode of Just Rolled In. We have some good photos and videos for today's episode, so sit back, relax, and enjoy. Yes, his exhaust is ratchet strapped to the drive shaft to hold it up. Oh boy. I wonder if they know the drive shaft spins and the exhaust gets hot. I don't think so. Thank you, GMC, for your innovation in the automotive industry. I don't get why car manufacturers do this. Maybe to piss us off? Who knows? But GM isn't the only company that does this. I remember some Fords are like this as well. It's Monday, alright? No sir, it's actually the turbo and cabulator foo-foo valve that's not working. And this one was sent in by a subscriber. Can't say I've seen this before. Yep, I'm gonna assume that's why it barely stopped. When the dealership lets a kid with zero manual transmission experience test drive a Mazda Speed 3. He must have been smoking that clutch the whole drive. That is screwed. By looking at that clutch, the car probably came in smoking like this. Well, well, let's see what's behind curtain number one. This is exactly what I thought of when I saw that picture. Good post or bad post? Oh crap, this sucks. That won't be cheap. Just saved this little guy. I had to remove the front end of the vehicle to do it, but he is now free and alive and well. I'm glad to hear that the rabbit is saved and doing well. Comment down below if you have ever had to remove an animal from an engine. I rolled into the vehicle. First of all, I don't think I could fit in there. Second of all, hell no. Considering bidding on a suspiciously cheap car in an online auction, claims to run but literally has a cactus in the engine. How do you think this happened? Can't say I've seen this before, but we also don't have cactuses where I live. This reminded me of this picture I shared in another video, where this guy's friends pulled a prank on him and filled up his engine full of pita bread. Had an Audi A4 come in with an upgraded Garrett and the used garden hose for the oil return line. That's a What the fuck is this? That? No. That. I gotta agree with this comment. This is just waiting for something bad to happen. Twenty twenty one Ram Pro Master twenty five hundred with only two thousand miles came in with a completely locked up left rear wheel. Dang, well I guess the good thing about this is that it'll be a warranty. Have you guys ever seen a fairly brand new vehicle have issues like this? Now we are going to show some cool and interesting vehicles that rolled into the shop. I'm at a loss for words. Honestly, I think it's pretty cool and creative. A pretty interesting way to make a motorcycle into a trike. Ford GT40. Honestly, my dream car. That's a beautiful color, and just in case you're wondering, the 40 refers to its overall height in inches. Rolled in for his regular yearly oil change. I'll take one of these also please, that is beautiful. If you want your awesome photos or videos seen on the channel, submit them to us on our Facebook page, link below. Well that's it for today's episode, thanks for watching and we'll see you in the next one.